I just created an account. Uh, I haven't solved anything uh, yet, so there's zero solves. With that being said, uh, just jumping into it today. Let's take one of these and uh, run with it. Uh, basic injection, web. All right, so I can already tell you. <laughs> this is going to be this is going to be one of those uh, SQL injections. Uh let's see what we've got. Uh basic injection. Um see if you can leak the whole database. The flags in there somewhere. More tools, dev tools again. Hope everybody's had a good uh, yesterday and today. I'm going to come in right off the bat. I'm going to take one of the ones that we know that usually splits out. So I think there's maybe something with the uh, the way I was originally putting that in. I put flag giver. I bet it's this right here. C T F learn boom. Solved. All right, here we go. Uh, I think the flag is somewhere in here. Would you help me find it? Um, yeah, I think we can do that. I think we can help them find this flag. Copy uh, and paste or uh, and we have a picture. So let's take this file. Uh, this is in downloads. We've been in, we've been playing around in downloads a little bit. So, um, uh, LSL that had some crazy name to it. I think it had this one. All right. So, or this name, we want to name this a one dot JPEG. So file a one dot JPEG, uh, JPEG image, standard density, segment, progressive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, strings a one dot JPEG. Uh, okay. That was pretty simple. Uh, right there it is. Uh, flag. Wow. Data is cool. Oh, that does work. Solve the challenge. It's time to pull out a programming one or all of these like super hard though. All right, let's do this one. Uh, we're going to go into simple programming and we're going to do the 30 point one. I think what we'll probably do is just keep doing CTF challenges until they get to like the hard levels and then just bail out. <laughs> uh, can you help me? Uh, we'll certainly try. I need to know how many lines there are where the numbers of zeros is a multiple of three or the number of one is a multiple of two. Please help me here. All right, let's go check this out. Who feels like some good math? ASCII text. Okay, that already. Uh, let's see what we've got here. Uh, cat data dot dat. Oh, okay, so this is the uh, just ones and zeros. All right, so we could uh, we could absolutely do that just strictly through. Um, we can just put it in Visual Studio. We will select dot net core console application. Uh, there's our console dot right line. Uh, we're going to come in here. We're going to add, we want to add all thought. Well, just show me everything. And then, uh, I'm going to grab the data. This is just going to be our data dot dat. That should be on copy always. Uh, that still says data dot dat. Let's run it. Okay, good. It's free. So this is an or right here. You could also use uh, these right here uh, for an and. We're just going to use this or. Final answer. I think we have it. I think we have it now. Uh, six 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 two. Did we get it this time? I'm I'm totally going to just do full Madden just a bit. No, I think that's right. Um. I know I've said that a couple of times, but that does make sense. There was somebody else who had dropped something in there like saying, hey, dude, uh, I don't think you should count the lines twice. 
I didn't listen to that person and I should have listened to that person. Uh, and so I think we get an answer. 6662. Uh, we're going to try that one and. Right, I'm heading to bed. Brett, I think you got one more in you. I think you get one more. <laughs> we're just going to do this last one. Uh, I'm totally just kidding. Uh, go to sleep if you uh, need to, and uh, I will chat with you on the next one. In the computer computing industry, standards are established to facilitate. Oh, yes, I can't even zoom in to not. Uh, are to facilitate information interchanges among American coders. I've made communication a little bit more difficult. Can you figure this one out? Input this output. Uh, output was ASCII is useful. Um, I think that's the code. I really believe that's the flag. ASCII is useful. I think that's it. You know, we dealt with one of these before. Um, uh, let's see. That looks like a flag to me, LOL. Awesome. Uh, so CyberShelf, if you don't have it, Let's do this real quick. Let's come back over. Uh, CTF L E A R N. I'm going to just set up a hot key for this thing. Um, okay, solved. Nice, nice, nice. This time I'll make it a little bit easier. We had one more. Just a smaller one. <laughs> 